Rhizidus, meaning root tooth, is an extinct genus of huge rope finned fish in the Coed Sarcoterygia. This is the type genus for the diverse group of large species known as Rhizodontids, which were, of which is the largest known. They ultimately belong to the Coed Tetrapodomorpha, making them relatives of species like Tiktaalik who took steps on the land, as well as, you know, later tetrapods. All of these groups are in turn lobe finned fish, also known as Sarcoterygi. And they include a variety of extinct species, but also two known living groups the lungfish in the Coit Dipnoi and the Actinistia or Coelacanths. Lungfish are closer related to tetrapods than coelacanths, but both are actually closer to even humans, reptiles, and frogs than they are to other fish groups. Remains of Rhizidus are primarily known from Ireland and Scotland, but some reports suggest a possible presence in North America, which is plausible given that North America and Europe were not separated by the Atlantic Ocean during the Carboniferous period. The defining feature of this species compared to other giant lobe fins like Baramita with the two 22 cm or 8.7 inch fangs near the front of the jaws, followed by other teeth scaling downwards in size. Rhizidus reached an estimated length of up to 7 meters, just over that of a great white shark, making it a massive fish, like other relatives like Baramita. Fossil skin imprints show that Rhizidus had large plate like scales, some of those found on modern day Arapaima. Sorry for mispronouncing that one. Behavior and habitat. Rhizidus was a giant apex perv that lived in freshwater lakes, rivers, and large swamps during the Carboniferous period, preying on small to medium sized amphibians, using its teeth to kill prey and rip it into digestible sizes rather than swallowing prey whole like other smaller toothed lobe finned fish. It has even been proposed that Rhizidus may have lunged at terrestrial shore bound prey just like a modern day crocodile. Or alternatively, like that of sharks.